Today we're making whipping cream from three basic ingredients, soy milk, a deodorized coconut oil, and a little bit of sugar. The key here is to blend it at a very specific temperature, then we chill it down in the fridge, and then whip it up. And to blend coconut oil, which is solid when it's cold, we need to melt it. So we start by doing that either in the microwave or in a small pan over low heat. So you want this coconut oil to be around 40 degrees and your soy milk to be chilled from the fridge. We add the soy milk, the sugar, and fancy blender. You could be using a hand blender too. You do need some mechanical aid because whiskey or just, yeah, is not gonna cut it. You need something that's gonna generate high shear so of uh, blending to really combine this. So the way I check an emulsion is by holding it up to the light. So I get a spoon and take a bit of the, the liquid that I'm emulsifying. You want to see in the, when you hold up the back of the spoon to the light or look at the cream that there is no oily streaks. That way you know that the oil has been blended down to the smallest globule and it's been dispersed within the cream and it's being held there in suspension. So when you look at the cream in the light, Look at the reflection that it makes and you should see no oily streaks. It should just be shiny and streak free. So the next step is just chilling down the cream. So we need to pour it into a shallow dish. So just putting a piece of cling film on it. Remember you want it in a nice thin layer because this you want it to chill as quickly as possible because we want to lock in that emulsion that we've just created mechanically by chilling it down and setting everything in place. So we need to chill the cream for about three to six hours. We want it to be fridge temperature or three to five degrees Celsius before we use it. So it's definitely a good idea to prep it the night before or earlier in the morning before your big baking session. So our cream has been chilling in the fridge for at least four to six hours. We need to make sure that it's really cold, that our bowl is cold. I'm gonna be very brave and whisk it by hand, but I'd recommend using a stand mixer or you'll be here for a very long time. So here we go. There we have it, our plant-based whipping cream, ready to use, ready to be folded into whatever luscious preparation your heart desires.